Hello all, my name is Abhinav Singh, an assistant professor from Department of Computer Science, Kite Group of Institutions. Today the topic for the discussion is dictionary techniques and we'll go through with one of the type of the dictionary technique which is known as static dictionary. So earlier, when we have the earlier uh, some compression techniques, we have seen that we replace individual symbols with some variable length of code words but in dictionary compression we will have a variable length of substrings which will be replaced by some short and possibly even fixed length of code words now compression is achieved in this particular technique by replacing the longest strings with some shorter code words now there are two types of dictionary techniques the static dictionary technique and the dynamic dictionary technique which is also known as adaptive dictionary technique so we'll go through with the static dictionary technique with the help of one of the example uh, is dictionary encoder in static dictionary what we have we have the prior knowledge of resources that is very important we already built one particular dictionary and on the basis of that dictionary will encode our given input sequence which could be a long sequence one of the example of a static dictionary is a dictionary encoder so we'll try to find out we'll try to understand uh, with the help of that dictionary encoder about the static dictionary technique now the diagram encoder in this form of coding the dictionary consists of all letters of source alphabet followed by as many pairs of letters called diagrams as can be accommodated by dictionary now how that particular uh, diagram encoder works let's see the diagram encoder reads two character input at a time okay and it will search that particular uh, uh, pair of character input in that particular dictionary which we have already built or which which is already given to us now if we find that particular combination of characters in our dictionary then whatever the uh, respective code word is given at that particular entry will replace that entries with that code word and if in case if we uh, do not find that uh, pair of characters in that dictionary we'll try to find out the first character of that pair if we find out that pair we'll code that uh, if we find out that particular single character we code that uh, character and the second character will become the first character for the next diagram and that procedure will be repeated till our given input sequence is not getting finished so let's take the example that we have given the five letters a b c d r and there is one dictionary uh, is given to us that dictionary has some code and some entries and on the basis of that given dictionary we need to encode the sequence a b r a c a d a b r a now select we'll start by selecting two uh, pair of characters in that particular sequence so select the first two characters a b so we select the first two characters a b now we find out that uh, combination of characters in the entry of the given dictionary so whatever the code has been given respective to that particular uh, combination will replace that code c here this is the combination we select and this is the code we find out then we select the next two characters but this entry is not in this particular uh, dictionary so what we'll do we'll try to find out the entry for the first character that is r a r now for the r we have the entry so we replace the r with this particular code 
and a will become the next the first character for the next diagram and the next two characters will be ac now again we find out the entry for the ac so we replace that code with that particular entry and this process will continue till we find out the code word for that c ab 101 r is 100 ac is then encoded then ad is encoded ab is encoded then for r and for a so this is uh, the diagram encoder and this is how we perform the static dictionary technique for uh, the compression thank you